Okay, we're going to do a mental block. This young man, is uh, his mother has agreed to let us uh, do this video. It's, it's going to end up on YouTube, and they know that. Right now, he's actually got lalicane, which is a, a topical anesthetic that is in the gingival mucosa. He's numbing, we're numbing him up so he can have a, a painless injection. So we're using bupivacaine, correct? Correct. All right, 0.5%. Yeah. And uh, so, all right, so let's go ahead and get this done. Okay. So when you approach the patient, we already have him numbed up and we've already located where we were going to go in. But when you want to locate where the mental nerve exits, there's a couple ways to palpate. But the best way is, so he's a kid, he doesn't have premolars. On an adult, you'd look just anterior to the second premolar. For him, it's going to be just posterior to his canine. And you put your finger down inside the reflection of the buccal mucosa and just feel for the little notch of the foramen of the where the mental nerve exits and you could just feel it right there posterior to that canine and the reason we did both sides is as you can see the laceration approaches and is almost on top of the midline and you do have some crossover fibers um, from those mental nerves that we want to hit both sides make sure crossover fibers aren't innervating the middle of this laceration okay so, so as you're localizing that, you're, you're feeling it in, internally, but then you also felt it externally too, yeah. correct? Mm -hmm. Okay. Go ahead. Okay. So we're just going to poke in. And at the same time, I'm feeling from the outside to see where my needle tip is. Perfect. Because you don't want to inject into the foramen itself because you don't want to cause neurovascular damage by putting too much pressure inside the foramen. So I'm just above where I felt previously. <coughs> Okay. And I'm going to inject one to two cc's, nice and slow. It's going to sting a little bit. And I feel my wheel building under my finger Okay, as well. it's right there at the foramen? Yeah. All right. So there's about one and a half to two cc's. Good okay. job. Okay. We'll go do the next one. And we'll massage that here in a second. Let's get this next one in. I'm going to relocate it. There it is, right under his canine on this side. Okay. So I'm going to pull back. Mm. And poke in. I'm right over the foramen. I'm going to put, do a little withdrawal, make sure I'm not in the artery or vein, and put in about one to two cc's. Okay. And then we'll just massage it in. And I can feel the wheel right over. You did good, man. Is he, is he numbed up is the question. You feel that? Mm -mm. Yes. All right. Sounds good.